When we are ill, we go to the doctor. However, there are many things we can do to stay in a good state of health and to avoid illness. What is health? Most of the time, our bodies function correctly and we feel well. We say that we are in a good state of health or we are healthy. To be healthy, not only our bodies must function well. We must also be in a good mental state and have good relationships with our family and the people around us. Therefore, health can be defined as a state of complete physical, mental and social well-being. When a person falls to maintain any of these three states, the condition known as illness occurs. Various signs indicate that we are not functioning correctly. These signs are called symptoms. Fever, swelling, itching, dizziness, or pain are some of the symptoms that can indicate illness. The importance of prevention. Healthy habits can prevent us from falling ill. The habits that help to maintain good health and avoid illness are called prevention. This includes all of those habits that we consider healthy. Hygiene, rest, exercise, a balanced and complete diet, and a correct posture. Visiting the doctor for routine checks ups and vaccinations is an important part of prevention. Many factors influence health, such as nutrition, rest and exercise. Some risks to our health include alcohol, tobacco, drugs and traffic accidents. Alcohol is common in our society. However, it can, it can present serious health risk. Alcohol causes effects in our health, like loss of reflexes, blurred vision, intoxication, and alcoholism. Smoking tobacco is one of the most damaging habits a person can have. Tobacco can damage the circulatory system and the respiratory system. Passive smoking occurs when non-smoker breathes in smoke from someone who is smoking. Drugs. Drugs are mind-altering substances. Some types of drugs can be alcohol, tobacco, heroin, cocaine, and pills. Drugs effects can affect personal relationships, antisocial behavior, dependency, and in some cases, death. But remember, say always no to drugs. Traffic accidents are the primary cause of death and injury. What can we do to avoid traffic accidents? As drivers, we can respect speed limits, maintain the correct safety distance from other vehicles, Always wear a seat belt. Children should use the appropriate seat for them. And finally, remember to follow all, all these factors if you want to be a healthy person.